I do believe we are all Europeans. I, I don't think the Romanian society has any lessons to offer yet. Uh, the current uh, civic wave, let's call it like this, uh, started last year, let's say in, in January, but it's very targeted. Uh, it, is, uh, it is a civil voice, if you want, against corruption, against kleptocracy, and against the whole political class as, um, as, um, as it is, it is it, and it has been perceived as the main uh, as, as the main danger for the society as a whole and um, probably one of the very few lessons that I could draw right now is uh, consistency and um, obstinacy uh, when it comes to um, working through this um, time of uh, time of crisis but uh, Basically, there are no uh, no leaders, Romanian leaders, in the streets these days. They don't have a clear a clear cut agenda. They are still struggling to find ways to uh, establish new uh, uh, civic movements, maybe new political parties and new movements. But at the same time, there is this um, um, inertia of the system as a whole, of the old elites, of the neo nomenclatura, of the kleptocrats. And it's a day-to-day -day struggle, it's a day-to-day -day struggle. I don't see the light at the end of the tunnel yet, but it's important that people are taking the streets, not just in Bucharest, also in other major cities of the country, and they are um, making their voice uh, heard, not just by other Romanians who are less active and more passive, but also uh, by, by the Europeans and uh, the Brussels and, and, and so on. And, um, uh, it's been amazing in this sense, and it also, as far as I know, at least last year, it kind of it kind of influenced what was going on in the neighboring countries, such as Serbia, such as Bosnia, and uh, maybe Bulgaria, and so on. So there is um, uh, there is a contagion, not just in, in 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 the bad aspects of our political life, also in the in the positive and the shiny shiny side of things. So, I'm pretty much optimistic about the future, although I don't know how it will it will look eventually. Not from here. I am familiar with a city and a little bit with the history of the city. Uh, in 2007, I was here when, when Sibiu was the European cultural capital and uh, the current Romanian president, Klaus Johani, was the mayor of the city. And um, um, I, I, I have come to realize in time that this city might, might just be the, 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 right, uh, the right example for other cities in Romania in terms of what you call uh, um, uh, interaction between minorities, interaction between uh, the civil society and uh, uh, local politicians, or the national, uh, at the national, or the politicians at, at the national level. So yes, uh, it is uh, it is uh, clearly an example of uh, of uh, good practice in terms of uh, NGO activities and human rights activities. It, it is also, if you look around, it is also an example of how. Uh, 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 an architectural legacy, a cultural legacy can be preserved and contained and uh, even uh, made available for, uh, for, uh, for foreigners. It's, it's an example of normality in a, in, a, in, a, in, a, in a country ravaged and cleavaged by so many tensions and, and latent conflicts.